Okay, this is <clears throat> my uh, review slash rant about the Sovol SV04. Going to go on my Amazon review. As you might be able to tell, it is in a little bit of disassembly because, um, yeah, <laughs> this thing worked for about a month and a half, two months, and then layers started not sticking, um, stuff stopped sticking to the print bed, um, I would have to recalibrate the um, print heads because they would get out of alignment pretty much every two or three prints. So, I contacted their customer service, <clears throat> and they sent me two brand new, um, uh, extruders. I spent the better part of an afternoon figuring out, because they didn't send you any instructions, nor are there any instructions on their website or their YouTube channel, taking this entire thing off, rerunning the cables up into this board here on both sides, and still didn't work still didn't work because even with the print bed as high as it would for some reason the nozzle would not touch the print bed even with this at its lowest setting and with this at its highest so then they send me brand two brand new hot end assemblies two brand new hot ends brand new nozzles brand new thermistor brand, brand new heaters so I get all that put together. I'm like, okay, this should fix it. But then I plug it in and I get this. I've checked the wiring, none of the wiring's frayed. I've made sure that everything was plugged into the right thing. This is the biggest hunk of junk I have ever had in my entire life. Do not buy this under any circumstances whatsoever because I have tried repeatedly to beg them because their war their website says they have a one year warranty. And I have begged them over and over again, send me a new one or give or give me my money back. And they keep hemming and hawing and sidestepping the question and, you know, hey, try this, try that, try this part, we'll send it out to you. Which, by the way, these things took the better part of three weeks to show up. The hot ends took the better part of two weeks to show up. So, yeah, don't buy this printer. Don't buy from the company. It, both the company and the printer are absolute garbage. Now, if you listen in the background, you can probably hear this guy going this is the bamboo labs p1s and this is a far superior printer it's a few hundred dollars more but trust me it's way better has way better auto leveling and it has four different col um, colors you can print with expandable up to 16 if you want to pay some more extra money this, this, I, I wouldn't use this as a doorstop. So, yeah, that's it. Rant over.